no, no need to overcomplicate it. That's a good, cool. clear, short, attention-grabbing home light like subject this. line. I generally advise against referencing yourself as much as possible in the especially in the first sentence and this immediately if puts the focus on them if you're able to write an entire email without saying the words i or me you're gold i don't mind it there because you're making the transition to trying to connect with him over something kind of unique that you both share shock him into attention a little humorous. Okay, so uh, now shifting into the one thing I want to ask about the role that I'm applying for. If you acknowledge that it's a bait and switch by saying that it's awkward, yes. all of a sudden when you go into this, it's, it's different. It's not as heavy. Think of a specific problem that you assume they might have so that he doesn't have to think. Of, like if you ask a question which was what are some of the problems well then he has to think about do we have problems okay what are they which one should i answer remove all that friction by asking a clear question that he can answer pretty directly you're basically pitching yourself by asking him how they do it because the idea is if he answers that question you're already going to show that you understand the nature of the work and then you're tying it quickly back to you worked at Airbnb, you faced that similar situation, and that's why you're curious how it's affecting them there. In your signature, you can be like, I'm a scene, look, now, hey, it's about me looking for a role in strategic partnerships at a company that exactly describes them. <laughs> if, if you land this, he's going to walk away remembering, yep. if not your name, the guy who emailed him about this role is into winemaking. 